asked me to show how to inflate and how to tie decker bubbles. Actually, they should not be that difficult. First thing to know is leave the decker bubble as long as possible in the bag because in the bag you will find a moisturizer. And you need this because the plastic needs to be humid to remain stretchy. I have here in my hands a 24 inch deco bubble printed all around with stars. We can insert any balloon that we want, so maybe we want to go for the mouse heads. If you have shaped balloons, I find it always a good practice to help the shape. So if I would have hearts, I would pull on both sides on the lobs to help the shape to be more pronounced. This is exactly what I would do with the mouse heads. So I would personally help the two ears in this mouse to stretch. Inserting the balloon inside the deco bubble can be done with any stick. So I have this aluminium stick, but it could be a chopstick or anything else. Roll this around the stick and I pull the ear over the stick that will help me to hold it. And then insert the balloon in the deco bubble. Inserting the mouse head should not be too difficult. I lay this open and now I can start inflating this balloon. Could be that I use a tilt valve, perfect. Could be that I use a push valve, perfect. Or it could be and that's what we're going to use today, that you have a trigger valve. All these work perfectly. As you see, I start by inflating first of all the bubble. Then I follow by the latex balloon. Now the easiest way for everybody is just to use some scrap 260Q or 160Q. Take it here in your hand and take a long end and go around and around and around and around as many times as you wish. Just make sure at the end that you pull tight onto this balloon. Now you can use this 160Q or 260Q to tie it off. You can use the 160Q, 260Q to use clusters or anything that you want to attach. Or you can simply continue to work with the neck of this balloon. So let me, for instance, cut off the 160Q. I take this neck. I take some ribbon and I will hold it exactly the same way that I would be tying any 11 inch balloon by holding a ribbon like this, holding the neck in between the next fingers, pull on the latex and turn around. Maybe you want to hold it at this point. Continue 
put it between your fingers and boom, close it off. If you want to know more about tying latex, find the other film that I posted on YouTube. You can just secure the ribbon by adding an extra knot. From here on, you can finish it off any way that you want. So, this could be a plastic. I hold the neck, the latex next between my fingers, so I can perfectly stretch this out. Easy? Now that we have this, all the rest should be easy. So what about the 20 inch deco bubble? This is a new one with a print all around. And I'm gonna use that with a simple 11 inch. The 11 inch is printed with Just Married. Again, I can roll this around the stick. Insert till the necks are aligned. I take my trigger valve. I first of all inflate the bubble. wrinkles like this and then follow with the 11 inch check and as soon as the wrinkles are gone you're good now I can imagine that you're not happy with the positioning of this balloon remember it has just married but you only can see it from this side should be very easy hold the balloon here Push it further into the bubble and now you should be able to start turning this balloon in any way that you wish. Push. You see? And now I'm exactly where I want it to be. Perfect. And I stretch this neck to the, to the bottom so it's properly fixed. Check again. Yep. Yeah. That's what I want. A bit of 160Q and around and around and around and around and around we go. Pull. It could be that you find it easier to hold the balloon between yourself and the table. Here we go again. So, what? If we would just use some nylon line, probably you cannot see this on the screen, but I made a loop in a nylon line which is already attached to this base. I simply put the neck of the latex balloon through the loop and again I can tie this off in a very very easy way. If I wish I can already insert details. So for instance this tool, latex neck, around, insert between my thumb and index and plop, here we go, attached. I only need to attach a cluster. And I just did hide all the mechanics. Sellable? I would think so. See you next time.